and welcome back to the next video and today we're going to start with unit 3 and the title of this unit is people Yarzit. so we're going to start with reading with an, a reading activity and it says here do you know the man in the picture what is he famous for the mathon so do të vazhdojmë me kapitullin e tret edhe titulli i këtij kapitulli është njerëzit. Do të fillojmë me një aktivitet për lexim. Edhe ushtrimi i parë po thot a din diçka për kët njeri un kët burrin në fotografi. Edhe për çka është i famshëm ai? Është mirë me shkru për gjigjen, çka mendoni normal në gjuhën angleze. Edhe pastaj e marim këtu një shambull e kemi ku do ta krahasojmë do me thonë mundi me krahasu përgjigjen e juj me përgjigjen e me thonë këto që e kemi. Vetëm i krahasu. Ok, në qofë se do një me dit a keni gavime a jo, mundi një me shru në koment përgjigjen apo më shru në mënyrë private në Youtube ose në këtë emailen që e kam këtu të caktum të description. Ok, let's start. Uh, before before I continue with the answer, you can try to pause this video and try to uh, give an answer. Me thon, para se me vazhdu me përgjigjet, është mirë ju me ndalë vedo në dhe me provu me, me shkru diqka. Okay, so let's see the answer. The man in the picture, in the pictures, because there are two pictures, is Lionel Messi. He is a famous football player, both for Barcelona and Argentinian na national team. The Argentinian national team. Okay, the mathon tuikan more this kamun that mention char the loy factis you didn't the mathon per katloitar. Tani do tashi chomnia vedo, e kemi disa pytje edhe disa aktivitete me kat vedo, sigurisht per katim. Let's watch the video. Lionel Messi. His nickname is the Flea because he's small and fast. Lionel Messi is clear. Messi just tried to loft it in, and anything that Messi tries, Messi can do. Today we look at the life and career of Leo Messi. He just never ever disappoints. Goal after goal after goal, and so many of them quite breathtaking in their execution. Lionel Andres Messi is from Rosario, Argentina. As a child, he is short, but Messi is great at football. He's just 13 years old and FC Barcelona discovers him. He and his family move to Spain. Messi is really good and quickly goes up the levels. His debut for Barca C comes at age 16 and one year later, he is already with Barca B. It's May the 1st, 2005, and Messi is the youngest club player to score for Barcelona in a La Liga game. He also helps Argentina win the FIFA World Youth Championship and wins the tournament's best player title. This makes him one of the game's most talented up-and-comers. Messi is about 1.7 meters tall and is very fast and strong. This makes him similar to fellow Argentine football star Diego Maradona. However, Messi is not only a goal scorer, he also helps other players. The 2005 to 2006 season is an important year. Messi extends his contract until 2014 and gets a pay rise. The team wins La Liga and the UEFA Champions League. Messi also returns in time to represent Argentina at the 2006 World Cup. Messi's similarities to Maradona continue when he copies his goal of the century in April 2007. Later, he also copies him with his handball goal. Messi finishes the year with 14 goals in 26 matches and plays for Argentina at the 2007 Copa America. By 2007 to 2008, he is a star, but he hurts himself again. The next season he is back and better than ever. He helps Argentina win an Olympic gold medal in Beijing, and he has a strong healthy season with Barcelona, where he plays in Ronaldinho's position. In 2008 to 2009, he scores 38 goals in 51 games, 
and helps Barcelona win the Copa del Rey, La Liga and the Champions League. Messi doesn't slow down. He leads Barcelona to a 2009 FIFA Club World Cup win and is the highest scoring player of 2009 to 2010. In 2009, Messi beats Cristiano Ronaldo when he takes both the Ballon d'Or and the FIFA World Player of the Year award. Messi's wins continue on April the 6th, 2010, when he scores four goals in one game against Arsenal. He becomes La Liga Player of the Year and joins Argentina at the World Cup. After a strong start the next season, another player hurts him. He soon gets better and scores even more goals. He wins the Ballon d'Or again in 2010 and helps Barca win La Liga and the European Cup in 2011. Oh, no, no. Oh! At the 2011 FIFA Club World Cup final, Barcelona beats Santos FC and Messi wins the Man of the Match title. He also becomes the second player ever to win the Ballon d'Or for three years in a row and is the first ever UEFA Best Player in Europe. On March the 7th, 2012, Messi is the first player to score five goals in a Champions League game. And here's Messi! It's Champions League history for Lionel Messi. Nobody has ever scored five goals in a Champions League match before, but nobody has ever played Champions League football quite like Lionel Messi. Soon after, he beats Rodriguez's record of 232 goals and is the highest scoring Barcelona player ever. Not only is Lionel Messi one of the world's highest paid football players and the owner of countless records, he also works for his charity that helps poor children. He is one of the greatest footballers of all time. Messi believes he does so well because of his family. Family is very important to him, and when he doesn't play football, he likes spending time with them. He always says, I am the happiest man alive. Okay, that was quite a story. Let's uh, do some questions. So these, these questions are very simple. Uh, we're just going to read actually the statements that we have here. And uh, we're just going to tell if these statements are true or false. Uh, if you need to watch the video again, just go back and watch the video again. The Maton Tash Knami book to him in the Sala de Clarota, Sla Duhat, Metreguayan Vertita, Apoyot Vertita, the Maton Nabas Vedo Sershichu, Chosekin Navoy Muktim Vedo Pravet, the Mundanimesh Kumrapa, Mektupak Minutaj and the Pasta Vajdoi. Okay, so let's start with the first one. So before we start, Paraset Filon, T is for true, the Maton Taya, or for true, Chikimi Pasta Mahir the Vertit, F is for false, Apoyapa Vertit. Now, Lionel Messi. Uh, Lionel Messi's nickname is the flea because he bites other players. Is it true or false? So this is false. Uh, in 2001, Barcelona discovers Messi. He is just 11 years old. So how old was he when Barcelona discovered him? Let's see, it's false. Messi is Diego Maradona's son. Let's say true or false. It is false. In 2007, Lionel copies Maradona's goal of the century. It is true. During the 2008 to 2009 season, Messi scores three, 38 goals in 51 games. It is true. And in 2012, Messi scores seven goals in a Champions League game. And let's see the last one, it is false. Okay, now let's go back to uh, the next exercise here. And we have two. Which of these sta uh, sentences are true about him? Which are false? So, a prapkin a bot in Jaishman, Evan Chofse, Evapsas Nukemilezu and Dick, to Yan Vatum Po Hamen Soim, Chkamen Donio. The first one, he gets up very early true or false he has breakfast after he goes jogging he trains only in the mornings he is short 
He watches TV in his free time and his family is special to him. Thun e bëni qka ja u mermendja, pas taj. E kemi këtë tregime në të ku do të ndëgjojmë edhe e kemi me ledzu, dhe me thonë mundin i ndërkua dhe me ledzu. Edhe pas taj i shqyqojmë fjalit ma herët a i keni pas cakta apo gabim. So, let's see. Let's listen. Lionel Messi, we are the best. Fact file, nickname, The Flea. Date of birth, 24th of June, 1987. Place of birth, Rosario, Argentina. Lionel Messi is a great footballer. He usually gets up very early at 6.30 a.m. and goes jogging. After that, he eats breakfast and then takes a shower. At 8 a.m., Lionel goes to football training. Lionel always has a lunch break at about half past two and then rests for a while. At 4 p.m., he continues training. On the field, Lionel often scores goals. His nickname is the Flea because he is small and fast. People say he has got magic feet. He is the only player to score five goals in one match in the Champions League. When Lionel doesn't have training or a match, he likes to relax and play video games. He also works for his charity that helps poor children. His family is very important to him and he likes spending time with them. I am the happiest man alive and I am happy for myself, my family and my country, he says. Okay, so uh, this was the story. Now let's go back to uh, the sentences again and we will reveal the answers. So let's see the first one. He gets up very early, it's true, and we can see it here. He usually gets up very early at 7.30 a.m. He has breakfast after he goes jogging, it's true goes jogging after that he eats breakfast he trains only in the mornings it's false because it says here at 8 a.m lionel goes to football training at 4 p.m he continues the training so he goes there two times he is short it's true let's see here he is small he watches tv in his free time it's false because when Lionel doesn't have training or a match, he likes to relax and play video games. And his family is special to him, it's true, because he says his family is very important to him and he likes spending time with them. So these are the answers here. Let's continue with the last exercise of uh, this video. It says here, exercise number three. Read the text and match the headings A to D to the paragraphs 1 to 3. One heading is extra. E kemi ushtrimi në fundit për këtë vedo, atër qka kena me vuktu e kemi kryetitojt A, B, C, D. Në me thonë, early start, free time, a typical day during the match. Në me thonë, filimi i hershëm, koha e lirë, një ditë tipike dhe tipike për gjatë ndeshjes. Ta është i qka këna me bo ju këtu, dhe me thonë, kretitojt, kini mi lidh me paragrafet që i patëm tekst. Ta është do të shohim tekstin prap, po mundeni me këthy të pjesa kur e ka ledzu, dhe me thonë, me ndal, ose me ndëgju prap, edhe pas taj me i lidh. Njona prej kretitojve, dhe me thonë, është shtese, këtu janë 4, këtu janë vetëm 3 paragrafa, të shohim. Këtu e kemi 1, 2, 3, dhe me thonë paragrafi i par, i dytë edhe i tretë. Ta shio duni me ditë, dhe me thonë paragrafi i par për qka po fletë, apo fletë për filimin e hershëm, apo fletë për kohën e ti të lirë, për një të tipike, apo gjatë ndeshje se qka ndodhë. Ta është në basë të kontekstit të paragrafit, ju duheni me lidhë me kryetitojt. Mundeni me filu, apo pëllëshojnë në qështo, ju qëtash mundeni me ndalë, dhe me thonë vedon, edhe me ledzu edhe një herë, edhe pas taj, dhe me thonë, kore lëshaj, i shohim bashkë për gjithjet. Ok, let's start with the answers. So, number one is C, sorry, a typical day, and let's see why. Tu e kemi a typical day. Sa po thot, gets up early, eats breakfast, takes a shower, has lunch, at 4 p.m., what does he do then? He rests, half past two, he rests, and so on. Dhe me thonë, 
Këtu përna të regojmë, po indikojmë se qka për bënë është një ditë tipike, po të regojmë vetëm për ditën për rutinën e ti ditore. Number two is D, during the match, and let's see why. On the field, on the field, dhe me thoni bjerë në fush, kështu që qa bënë në fush, ndeshje. Score goals, prapa jo. He is fast, dhe me thoni në fush, gjatë ndeshje, së është shumë i shpejt, magic feet, dhe me thoni ka këmb magjike. And the last one, number three is B, free time, and let's see why. B, free time, when Lionel doesn't have training or a match, he likes to relax and play video games. Të me thonë vetëm po, po nën kuptohe që ai kur nuk ka trajnema, po nën do një ndeshje, ai ka qef më relaxu edhe me luit lojra kompjuterike. So, these were the answers. And... Let's meet to the next video and we will continue reading about Lionel Messi. So hope this video was useful to you. Hope you learned some new words. Even if we didn't translate, then qofse nuk e na për këthy, është mirë ju qas keni kuptu me i këshur në Google, apo më më shkru, apo keni mjë ratë ndryshme ku mundin e mi gjithë për këthy me të aty në fjallve. Dishka tjetër që mundit mi hëndi mu është me për këthy kretë mësimin. është teknikë shumë e mirë për me i majtë me në fjallve. Ok, so... Hopefully this was useful to you and see you in the next video. Goodbye.